Now a two-time GMAC Men's Soccer Athlete of the Week from Cedarville. Again, joined by senior midfielder Zachary Harris. And uh, Zachary, clinching home field advantage throughout the playoffs is huge. Uh, what does the team do now to get ready mentally and physically for the postseason? Um, to be fair, we just kind of take it one day at a time. I mean, our coaches always talk about doing the little things correctly. So every practice... We just look. We just look at that practice as getting better and getting healed up because this late in the season we have a bunch of a bunch of different types of injuries. So just getting healed up and getting better each day. We don't want to look to the game quite yet because we're not there, and that can be really dangerous. Um, this was your second dramatic goal for you recently. Uh, you also had that overtime game winner against Alderson Broadus. Um, but how did this one happen in the 88th minute against Salem International? Like, like you said, um, it was really late in the game. Um, Bradley Schluter, he, he's our outside back, and he knocked the ball in after, like, Salem had, was a bit, they were a bit caught off guard because they had just cleared the ball. But Bradley put it back in, and John Brown got it down. And he was 1v1 with one of their defenders and just took a touch to me, and I just took a touch and hit it and prayed it went in. <laughs> uh, now, in that game against Salem International, Cedarville was up two goals earlier. Uh, what was the message for you when Salem managed to tie it up at 2-2? Um, it was the same message that our coaches have given us all year. You have, you have to keep playing. Whether you're up 3-0 at half, 4-0, or it's tied 2-2, like, you just have to keep playing. Like Anything can happen, and if you don't keep playing, then the team can get up 2-2 and steal the win. So we just kept continuing to play and create chances, and it paid off. And you guys really took it to Ohio Valley in your second meeting this year. Um, you know, Ohio Valley has beaten a couple of the, the top tier teams in the conference. Uh, is it fair to say that Ohio Valley is just not a team you can overlook anymore? That is definitely fair to say. Um, whenever you play them, they have a bunch of different dangerous players that can hurt you if you don't pay attention to them. Uh, if, you, if you overlook them, then they can hurt you just like the games they've won in the conference because... Like I said, they have a lot of quality players, and they're much more organized than they've been in the past. I think that's due to their new coaching and a bunch of new players as well. Zachary Harris, again, thank you for your time, and uh, we'll see you in the GMAC semifinals next. Absolutely. Thank you.